that has been the practice. Only other things, of course, mm. the Rangana Chief Minister's name should not go on record. Now, Sri Ajit Kumar Boyan, two minutes. Almost all the other parties are completed. Thank you, Honorable Chairman, sir. As I get a very short time, I will raise few points only. Uh, what I think touching of soft points is enough, as the government already knows everything, and tragically enough hides everything. Okay, Sir, from flood to price hike, the people of my state are some are suffering like hell, and the government goes with the same rhetoric. We cannot control price. High price hike for these reasons. If you can give neither job nor food or relief from calamities like floods, why there is a government at all? This is my question. Sir, I cannot understand why the pathetic financial condition of the country and its people's financial penury is directly proportionate to the meteoric rise of a selected few. The most recent data released by the Ministry of Statistics and Program Implementation, Government of India, saw that rate of inflation in India in the month of July 2022 has been 7%, while that of food inflation has 7.75%. If we look commodity-wise, we will find that the rate of inflation has been as high as 17 percent in case of vegetables, 9 percent for oils, 8.6 percent for fish and meats, 10.39 percent for fuel and light, and 9.5 percent clothing and footwear. Sir, it should also be noted that the rate of inflation in the country has remained over 6% for quite some time now. For instance, if we consider the period since January 2020, the average rate of inflation in India has been 6.17% for the last 30 months. Sir, why the data of various reputed international organizations on India's development index differ from our government's data? This is my question. Now we are manipulating even statistics of our development to whom we are lying actually. Sir, what is important here is to realize that in demand constrained condition, particularly the condition arising out of the pandemic inflation is only caused by increasing costs. A series of hikes in fuel prices, including petrol products, and the LPGs have only aggravated the situation. Right, Rajiv Kumar. Sir, one minute. The present inflation is thus triggered, of, triggered by faulty administration decisions. But to control inflation, the government needs to have sufficient handles. We are falling, sir. The question is whether the government has sufficient handles to contain inflation. We are falling, sir. I just want to remind this House that if we do not do anything, it will be an endless backward Thank journey. you, Ajit. Thank, Thank you, sir. Honorable members, this short duration.